one option for trying to improve vision at all distances is to have a multifocal lens implant uh, inserted into the eye. These implants are manufactured to produce multiple images that fall on the retina or photographic film at the back of the eye from dis different distances, far and near, and sometimes also at an intermediate distance as well. The brain learns to ignore the image it does not want and concentrates on the image that is clear at the distance required. The optics of these lenses are quite complicated and not without some compromise in the overall quality of vision. Some people notice glare symptoms and halos or starburst effects which are most troublesome when driving at night. Usually these effects reduce as your brain adapts to the new vision over several months but it can sometimes take up to six months for them to resolve. A very small number of patients are still sufficiently troubled after six months to require lens removal. As the light enters the eye it is divided up into different focuses and therefore there is less light available at each focus compared with a normal monofocal lens where all the light entering the eye has a single focus. This slight re slightly reduces the quality of vision at all distances but this is not particularly noticeable in good light however it can become more noticeable in poor light situations such as dawn or dusk situations or in a poorly lit restaurant. This is sometimes called loss of contrast sensitivity. This effect may be more noticeable as you age or if you develop macular degeneration. If you need very high quality vision, the distance and driving at night such as an HGV driver, then multifocal lenses should not be used or only used with caution. If you require very high quality vision at near such as model making, then it is unlikely that a multifocal lens alone will produce this level of near vision and glasses may also be needed for these detailed uh, visual tasks. There are however some new multifocal lenses uh, called the Symphony lens which is a type of extended range of vision lens which has a, a very good uh, track record in terms of minimising the uh, side effects that are often seen with multifocal lenses, in particular the problems associated with glare and halos and reduced quality of vision in reduced lighting. The lens itself uh, is best inserted in both eyes uh, and produces very good distance vision and some very good intermediate vision but sometimes glasses are still needed if the print is small or the lighting is poor for near. These intraocular lenses uh, can be inserted very easily but they are quite difficult to remove and therefore it is very important if uh, a decision is made to have uh, either a monovision situation or multifocal lenses that the patient is fully aware of the quality of vision to be obtained with these lenses and not all patients are suitable for these lenses. They work best if both eyes are healthy, all astigmatism is treated and the retina is healthy. They should not be used if there's any pathology in the retina and they should not be used if uh, there is astigmatism left untreated. However these lenses are now available in a toric variety and as a result of this patients with astigmatism who require uh, the extended range of vision lens are able to have a symphony lens inserted to correct uh, the uh, astigmatic component as well as giving them a range of vision at uh, all distances. Mm -hmm.